Welcome everyone to this short tutorial. In this tutorial I would like to show you how to produce not only documents but also documents that contains maybe your data but also all the other things uh, that are used to be stored in some kind of documentation of your applications and your formulas and your analysis. So most of you guys maybe already used our prior and you're producing a lot of lines and maybe oh sorry for that maybe in the end you're just adjusting and adding some comments to your analysis to to keep an eye on your analysis but if it comes to sharing and also um evolving your analysis um it is always like okay i, I have a document maybe a doc or tech document on the one hand I have some R code on the other hand. I'm producing PD uh, or I'm producing figures, plots, tables as well in R, and then I have to um, adjust it and yeah, copy it into your document. And um, therefore, Knitter, the so-called package Knitter for R, um, do that everything in one step. So, uh, but to keep in mind, it's just for producing tech and therefore PDF so you won't get any DLC um, word document out of that so um, let's start maybe with that very simple lines over here um, I'm just producing something like a graph uh, out of it so just click on run here and these are this is a table called daily daily returns of Nasdaq and um, yeah so how to how to how to make a document you can easily share and go away to other persons which will state what you are doing here and this is not uh, and uh, by that I don't mean you will give away that text file here we can store that uh, as well not on in an R file but in a text as well but as a PDF which looks nicely so how to do that um, yeah as I have said it's a so-called knitter package so first of all in our studio you have to install packages so-called knitter and it's now downloading and installing and in the end don't forget to type library knitter which will start or adjust knitter to your working working uh, session so now we are ready to go but first um, we have to make some um, customization on our work uh, on our preferences so first of all you normally set your working directory using the set wd command and um, due to that I've set it to this R metrics um, so um, this has to be in shape with the following so go on tools and options and you can see here there's an another default working directory when not in a project w which has to be set um, according to your working directory or otherwise so these both have to fit in e uh, to each other so what I'm doing now is I'm clicking on console and I say okay set WED um, you know make it easy um, I'm here in my folders more set as working directory get WD now oh, here we are that's great so let's go back to tools options and both of them both of them are um, fitting to each other and there's this option for sweep sweep is um, maybe something like the grandfather of knitter and um, we are using uh, Knitter on so-called RNV files, so adjust that uh, with RNV files using Knitter, and I was sticking with the PDF LaTeX option here and all the other options as well. So just press on OK and afterwards, and so here we are. Um, these are our codes, and we'd like to adjust or um, use them in your in our file. So what we need to do is we we need to do to create a new sweep file so this is now total tech so we have a document class article you can use a lot of docu um, different document classes um, of your favor also the Beamer class uh, so we have a document we will like to create a title 
for that minimal sweep or minimal knitter example in R and yeah of course we have an author as well so be proud of your work and yeah of course we like to have that title in our document so this is our workflow um, until now this is um, all stored in minimal.rnv click on save yeah um, until now this is totally only tech so I'm now clicking on compile PDF Oh, on undefined control sequence. Oh, there we are. Once again, click on um, compile PDF, and there it is. It's the last one, minimal PDF. Let's open that up, and as you can see, we have now created a PDF using Knitter out of R and not using some tech editor or something like that. So, this is very very easy so how to how to get these codes or these lines in your R file there's a special syntax for knitter which will say okay the following lines shouldn't appear in R uh, in the in the PDF but should be computed in R right right that at the same time you're producing the PDF so both of them the PDF and your analysis are both um both done parallel so that keeps track on both of them so what is the what is the um typo for that is it, is it uh, it's this and so we would like to set dot seed maybe oh no we can copy our commands that is much easier so yeah we would like to make this and the end line for that whole thing is the add so Nope, just press or saving it again, compile the PDF. So this is our workflow. As you can see we have the commands written in our uh, in the PDF as well. Um and also the output. So mean x creates an output and the variance of x creates an output as well. So this is um this is a command and what you would like to do as well is maybe you would like to have access to your uh, to your um to your variables inside or in the document and in line so um the first two elements of x r and now you can use s expression x so once again check this out so now we're having here the first two elements of x which is our string we have given to uh, to uh, Knitter and then you have here the two elements out of our x you can check here